Hi, this is Anjaneeru, Physics Faculty. Welcome to Narayana Online Classes. Today we are going to discuss about 7th class physics. Concept is dimensional formula and dimensions. The first bit is which of the following represents represents dimensional formula of dimensional formula of speed which of the following represents dimensional formula of speed first option m power 0 l power 0 t power minus m l t power minus third option m power 0 l t power minus fourth option m power 0 l t power minus so for identify the correct dimensional formula of the speed First, we should know about what is a speed. So, speed is equal to distance by time. So, here distance is a, a kind of length. So, that's why the dimensional formula of length is L and dimensional formula of time is T. So, this T goes to numerator, we can write we can write lt power minus 1. So then our final answer is there is no mass value m power 0 l is the t power minus 1. So m power 0 l t power minus 1. So first option is not correct. ml t power minus 2 t is not correct. m0 lt power minus 2 not correct. So here m power 0 and t power minus. So, fourth option is correct. Next, second bit. Dimensional formula of a dimensional formula of a physical quantity having units kg by meter cube. The first option is m l power 0 t power minus m L power minus 3, T power 0. Third, M, L power, uh, L, T power minus 3. Fourth option, M power minus 1, L power minus 1, T power minus 2. So first, which physical quantity represents regarding this unit? So here, Kz by meter cube. So, Kg by meter cube means mass by volume, mass by volume. So, here this mass by volume we can write as mass by length into breadth into height, height. So here the dimensional formula of mass m by dimensional formula of length l breadth l height also l. So that's why l into l into l l cube. So our answer here is m l power minus 3. So m l power minus 3 but there is no time dimensions. No time dimensions. So, first option wrong, 
second option m l power minus 3 t power 0 so according to this dimensional formula there is no dimension for time that's why t power 0 is there so that's why second option is correct next third view Dimension of time. Dimension of time in a in a dimensional formula of acceleration. Dimensional formula of acceleration first option is minus 1 second option is plus 1 third option minus 2 fourth option plus 2 so first if you write the dimensional formula of acceleration you can easily identify the dimension of time so what is acceleration generally Acceleration is equal to change in velocity, change in velocity by time. So here already well known to us, dimensional formula of velocity is lt power minus 1, the dimensional formula of time is t. So overall we t goes to numerator lt power minus 2. So the dimensional formula of acceleration is lt power minus 2. But they are asking the dimension of the time. So the dimension of the time is minus 2. That's why third option is curve. Next. Fourth one. Dimensional formula is not applicable to Dimensional formula not applicable to not applicable to First option is Trigonometric functions Second option is logarithmic functions. And third option is exponential functions. And fourth option is all of these. So according to rules of dimensional formula of writing, so what we are going to discuss here is whether it is a fundamental physical quantity or derived physical quantity, then we can be able to write the dimensional formula of physical quantities. So here if the physical quantity having no units, no units, no uh, units, either fundamental units or derived units, then we have no chance to write dimensional form. Now, in this bit point of view, dimensional formula not applicable, trigonometry functions. So, trigonometry functions having no units. So, that's why these are having no dimensional form. Logarithmic functions. So, logarithmic functions also having no units. So that's why logarithmic functions, we uh, have no chance to write dimensional formula. Exponential functions, so that is e power something like that. So for e exponential functions also, there is no any unit. So that's why we have no chance to write dimensional formula. So that's why these three 
functions uh, having more chance to write dimensional formula that's why dimensional formula is not applicable all these three functions so that's why fourth option is correct next fifth thing dimensional formula of force dimensional formula of force first option ml t power minus 2 second option ml t power minus 2 third option m power minus 1 lt power minus 2 Fourth option, young LT power minus. So here, first, what is the mathematical formula of force? Force equal to mass into acceleration. The dimensional formula of mass is capital Y. The dimensional formula of acceleration is LT power minus. So that's why the dimensional formula of force is m l t power minus two. M l t power minus two. So it is not correct answer. M l t power minus two. So second option is correct regarding dimensional formula of force. Okay. Thank you.